So, that's it, that's the box. And there are loads and loads of different types of melodions. First of all, there's lots of different uh, amounts of rows you can get. Now, if you don't know what I'm talking about, well, on this melodion, this is known as a two row melodion. There's a row of buttons here, and there's a row of buttons here, and you've got the bass buttons here. Now, this is probably the most common type of melodion. It is what's called a DG melodion. This row is in the key of D. This row is in the key of G. And uh, to go with those uh, buttons, those keys, you have notes and chords. So on this side you've got the bass buttons that work specifically with these keys. And I'll be going through that a little bit later in this video. So this is a two row DG melodion. Uh, you can get one row melodions in various keys, uh, G and C. Um, and you can get three rows. Uh, I think I've even seen five row melodions. So this is a typical eight button bass. Um, and I'll go through what the, the buttons do in, in a while. Uh, but I've seen 10 buttons on the bass side, 12, even 18. Um, some melodions have what is known as a stradella bass, which is it looks a bit like the piano accordion bass. And I'll show you that in a minute. I've got a piano accordion here, which I'll show you in a moment. And that's lots and lots of buttons, and that's a, a very different sort of setup on the bass. Now this type of melodion is called bisonoric, which is a very posh way of saying the buttons give you two notes. Bi, C2. So every time you play the button, as you push in, you get one note, you pull out, you get a different note. And the same mainly with the bass. So you push in, get one note, pull it out, get to get a different note. And on the chord, same thing, push in, get one chord, pull out, get a different chord. There are a couple of buttons here that give you the same uh, note and chord, both on the push and the pull. And you'll find that all of, this, all of these types of melodians give you that kind of setup. Um, so uh, that is called unisonoric, where you get the same note in both directions. Now, um, a piano accordion is unisonoric. I love that word. And it means to say, when you press the keys of a piano accordion, and again, I'll show you that in a moment, you get the same note where you're pushing or pulling the bellows, and the same with that stradella bass, which I'll show you, it's the same. But, um, so you might think, well, you know, why complicate the issue? Why have two notes on each button? Well, the idea is, in a very small span, about a nine inch span here, you've got a massive three octave range of notes and you can very quickly uh, move up and down through the scales um, without having to make massive leaps that like you would have to on a piano accordion keyboard. So uh, uh, bisonoric is a bit of a nightmare at first, but trust me, stick with it. It really does make sense and it is well worth the effort. So let's show you that uh, piano accordion, shall we? So this is a piano accordion and uh, as you can see, it's basically the same setup. Instead of buttons for the right hand, um, I've got keys. I've got like a conventional piano keyboard, uh, three sets of black, two sets of black, three sets of black, typical piano keyboard. And the notes get higher as you come down towards the floor, which is a bit of a strange concept, but it's exactly the same as it is on the melodeon. The bass, uh, this is what we call a stradella bass. Let's get a bit closer on this. So you can actually see this, all right? And you can see as I push in and pull out, it's the same sound. But, you know, basically the setup is the same. You've got the blocks of reeds inside uh, for the treble and for the bass. And the sound comes out of here for the treble and out of here for the bass. So, you know, it's essentially the same idea. Um, <clears throat> why would you choose a melodion over a piano accordion? I don't know, for me, I just think they're a bit cooler. I think a melodion is a little bit of a cooler instrument than the piano accordion, but though piano accordion is a great instrument. This is my wife's. She can play it a lot better than I can. Um, but just so you can see the difference, but to say some melodions do have this type of, of um, stradella bass and um, it is a bit of a nightmare if you've got quite big fingers. So uh, if you're not sure, get a melodeon. The buttons are a bit bigger, there's not so many of them, 
And uh, as I say, this, this bisonoric thing, it does work if you stick with it. But that is a piano accordion, and uh, we'll put that away because we're going to go back to our melodeon now. <laughs> 